feeling better, I hope. You look much better. You were very lucky, my friend. But let's get down to business. I have some things to tell you about our ghostly friend. Please update me on the Phantom's actions. I have a new note from him. It is the same handwriting as the previous note. What does the new note say? He wants Christine Day to sing the lead at the wedding of Isabel tonight, not Carlotta the star. Here's the note on top of the desk. Miss Christine Day shall sing the lead in the wedding of Isabel, not that toad, Carlotta. Please honor this request, or the tragedy that follows will be on your hands. What does the old note say? I told you about it last week. My, that bump on your head has really affected you. The ghost wants us to pay him a monthly salary and reserve one of the best boxes for him for every performance. The nerve! Here, read it yourself. It's in the tray. My payment of 20,000 francs shall be due the first of every month. Please give it to Madame Geary for placement in box 5, which shall remain unsold for every performance. Failure to comply with this request shall result in great misfortune. Which box does he reserve? Box 5. It's one of the best ones, too. We could sell it every night if we wanted. We never know when he will use it, so none of us have ever seen him. Madame Geary may have had some communication with him, though. Can I see Box 5? If it's not locked, you'll find it through the Loge Corridor. We have examined it thoroughly, I assure you. If the Phantom does go there, it is by Preston Dig... Prestis dis by magic. Tell me about Madame Geary. She looks after the boxes. She is the one who finds the notes the ghost leaves for us, usually in box five. It is about time for her to report to work, so you may find her cleaning the boxes now. Odd woman, I might add, but she does her job. Tell me about Christine Day. What do you mean? Aren't you two, well, haven't you two been seeing each other? Yes, but she doesn't talk much. Shy, huh? Some are that way, to be sure. She has quickly adapted the ways of a Parisian. None will ever be a true Parisian who has not learned to wear a mask of gaiety over his sorrows and one of sadness, boredom, or indifference over his inward joy. What do you want to know about her? Where does she come from? I knew her father before he died. He was a brilliant violinist with the orchestra. They emigrated here from Scandinavia, I believe. After her mother died, she was studying ballet when one of the directors heard her sing. What is her job here? She was placed immediately into the chorus. She has had two minor parts since then. She has never sung the lead. Is she really a good singer? Yes, she is. I am not sure if she could sustain a leading role. She is still young and undisciplined. But she has gotten better and better just over the last few weeks. It is as if she acquired an outstanding teacher. She improved leaps and bounds in, really, a, a few days. A teacher? What do you mean? Practically daily she comes in with some new technique, or it seems she has learned more about emotion, or her voice seems much stronger, it's a number of things. Things only a trained musician could hear in her voice. Someone is teaching her, there is no doubt. Will she sing the lead in The Wedding of Isabel? Yes, I have agreed to it. Besides, Carlotta has mysteriously gained a throat ailment. Otherwise, she would have thrown a fit. Thank you, monsieur. I shall see you later. Adieu, Raoul. You take it easy now, we... Oui?
What are you selling? Tickets to tonight's opera. Would you like a box seat? An orchestra seat? A mezzanine seat? Or our economy seat? Box seat, please. That will be five francs. Uh, is my credit good here? This is the Paris Opera House, monsieur. What do you think? Perhaps you should come back later when you have some money. May I help you, monsieur? Can I buy a ticket? I would be happy to help you, monsieur. Would you like a box seat, an orchestra seat, a mezzanine seat, or our economy seat? Economy seat, please. That will be two francs. Uh, I don't seem to have any money on me. Then I cannot help you anymore. Adieu. Who might I be addressing? I am Mame Gary. I am caretaker of the boxes. Tell me about the Opera Ghost's personal box. Box 5 is the Ghost's personal box. He has used it ever since he first began haunting the opera. What is so special about Box 5? It offers a first-class view of the stage. The boxes in this area are among the best seats in the house. And you have never seen him enter or exit? Never. It is a mystery. But he uses it, I know. How do you think he gets into the box? He's a ghost. How should I know? When did he first begin haunting the opera? It was really since it opened in 1875. I started working here in 1879. He has always been here to my knowledge. I heard tales that he was around during construction of the opera and even during the time of the Cominards. Tell me more about his work in the construction. He used the time and space to build his own domain deep below the theater. I believe he may have protected his lair with puzzles and traps. What kind of traps? He gained much knowledge of diabolical traps and puzzles while he lived in Persia. I have heard tales of a puzzle with toggle switches which correspond with the 26 letters of our alphabet. I know nothing more. <laughs>